Let's press the Monocles button. I was thinking Monocles didn't talk much, did she? Monocles, why? I'm good on my own. I want to be a best speech ever. Understandable. Have a good day. Ugh. All right, so now let's do Slavioni. Slavioni, I think I remember. I think I remember you made an entire vodka shop fall yesterday. Oh yeah, that's right. This is the shopping one. So yeah, let's just keep skipping. It's only natural for you to go to Sayori after all. She's uh, your childhood friend. Bosuki agrees this is the best solution. At least they agree on something. Sadly, I can't make them all happy in this situation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we're just doing the road. I don't care about anything else. I know all this. We, we did all this. Oh, that's a good skip speed. That feels good. That feels like quality skip. God, Suki Dev is really in love with the. <laughs> Lift a table! Wait, no, no, no. You know what? You know what? All things considered, I'm gonna do the somersault because it will change the world. Wait, hold on. I want to get I want to get one that like at least two of them liked, including Slaviori. Was it the double thumbs up that had some some work? Doesn't like it. Does like it. Doesn't like it. Slaviori, what do you think? It was so great. Oh yeah. Wow, we've really been through a lot, haven't we? Slaviori, I'll meet you tomorrow morning to go shopping. Monocles, your uncle Popsuki, I'll see you on Monday. Oh, that was just the one little alright. Going shopping with Slaviori isn't too bad of an idea after all. I'll just have to make sure she doesn't only buy vodka. Since I woke up pretty late, she must be awake already. I'll go get her. I get ready to go outside. Slaviori may still be asleep. She'll be pissed I haven't woken her up before. You're all gonna do that then. Hello! <laughs> no, hold on, I gotta be authentic. Hello! <laughs> Beat, I scared you this time, didn't I? Don't make me jump like that! <laughs> it's too funny! Didn't we say we go shopping? Of course we did, but since we're in the weekend, we can take our time. I just forgot to wake up, honestly. By the way, what are you doing in my house? I was born, so I want to see you, of course. Didn't you want to wake me up? Sika, of course I did. But I thought maybe you wanted to rest after what you did yesterday. So she really appreciated it that much? I appreciate it. Anyway, do you have some money on you to go shopping? Don't tell me. You don't have any money, is that it? Be it, not my fault. I bought too much vodka last week. Well, then you have all the vod- you can- No, last week. I'll pay for you. You're lucky I'm on your side, Slav girl. Yeah, thank you. Alright, so what do you want to do today? Hmm, shopping won't take much time, so why don't we hang out afterwards? When I think about it, it's true shopping won't take all day. And I'm not against a bit of time with Slav Yorg. Sounds good. Where do you want to go afterwards? Don't know. We'll see you after we're done shopping. Think about work before thinking about fun, says she. Let's get going then. Same shop as last time? Of course, Sika! Where else can I find enough vodka? Don't forget, we'll need food, too. You'll take care of it, don't worry. I'm worrying even more now. Slaviori is still humming the Russian anthem. She looks really happy today. Hey, Slav girl, don't break bottles this time, okay? Stop reminding me, you meanie! Passively fed up, Sadiori is the best. Just kidding. Please go on in, milady. Slaviori laughs and goes in. She immediately squats as fast as she can to the vodka section. She picks up eight bottles of Morkov. Slaviori. What is it? We agreed that we wouldn't take only vodka. I know! I'll get more on top of those bottles, don't worry! Did she forget who's paying? That won't do, Slav girl. It's too much. Let's see you take two bottles of vodka and I take something else. I'll be lucky if she doesn't start yelling at me. Be it alright then. I trust you, Ike. What? What did she just say? Why is she so tolerant? I'll go get some drinks. You choose your vodka. I wonder what people will drink. I decided to take some mores. Slaviori told me it was good. I still haven't heard the sound of shattered glass. Maybe things will go well today. I'm back. Look what I got for you. Be a You remember my favorite drink? 
favorite drink. I just took it because it's Russian. That was pure luck. Of course I did! See? We don't have to only take vodka. Mm, maybe you're right. I am right. Now what food did you choose? She looks at me with a suspenseful look. And gets a plastic container out of her bag. There! It's Sika Beep shaped Kibisk! Is she kidding? After taking a look at the container, I understand she's not kidding. Well, I guess that'll do, yeah. Of course it'll do. After all, I'm the one who chooses. And I'm the one who pays. Let's pay for all this and go around town then. Slaviori nods. Again, her expression got even happier when I told her we'd go around town. 1 p.m. already? Time flies. Where do you want to go, Slaviori? Beat, that's a surprise. Just follow me. I'll be the responsible one this time. I'm scared. Alright, let's go. You're not gonna, like, drop that stuff off at your house or anything? Your... School? Why, though? Hey, Slav girl, are you sure you didn't get lost? No, that's where I wanted to go. Piet, can't you trust me? Don't worry, I trust you. She walks me to the school entrance. I really wonder where she wants to go. I didn't know our school had a rooftop. Probably should've. Slaviori, this is... It's beautiful. It kind of reminds me of Mother Russia, you know. Does it? E. I love going on trains when I go back in Russia. I expected her to say something normal. Now that I think about it, you haven't gone back in Russia in a while, have you? Back to Russia? You can tell that Sikadev hasn't mastered English at this point. I usually, I usually go there during the summer. You didn't go last summer, though. Sika... Let's just say I did something bad last time. You can't go back because you did something bad? What the fuck has she done? I decided it would be a good idea to drive my tank around Moscow yelling Vladislav all over the place. I drank a bit too much that day. A bit. And don't you feel sad you can't go anymore? I used to, but now when I see those kinds of moments with you, yeah? It makes me feel like this is Russia, because I am happy in Russia. What a poetic way to see it. As long as you can be happy with me, with the lift club, it's all good. I'll always be there for you. I really don't forget to making you join the club yet. That may have been one of my good ideas. I gotta admit it was a good idea, Slav girl. Thank you. Slav Yuri looks at me. Her gaze is a bit vague. Is anything wrong? No, nothing. I was thinking about something. If anything's wrong, you're free to tell me, you know. I tell you it's all good, be it. You're so dense sometimes. There she goes again about me being dense. What's with that? Hey, Slaviori. I'm actually going to try the not say anything for later. But we got to ask her now. Would you like to go to the festival with me? Slavyori has a huge grin on her face. Be it, AK, yes! Thank you! I didn't dare asking you to go! So that's what she wanted. Then, let's meet on Monday evening in my class, alright? Actually, I imagine it's gonna be the same ending if I wimp out on anyone, so I guess... <laughs> I don't have it in me to do with the poor Slavyori. She's waiting so hard. I'll be there! I promise I won't be late, yee? That's quite a challenge. It's already getting late. Shall we go home? No, wait. I'm glad I could ask Slaviori. I feel like there's a lot I don't know about her. I want to know her more. And maybe I'll get some more free vodka on top of it. I'll get going now, okay? Beat, I can't wait to see you on Monday! Same Slav girl. I'll see you soon. She's humming louder than before. That's out of the way, at least. Now here comes the festival! I'll rest and practice my move tomorrow. I've got to be ready for my performance. I see a little squatting figure coming towards me. <laughs> hey, AK! Hey, Piet, you want to be for the festival? Oh my, Slavio is wearing a bow tie. How cute! <laughs> She's got twin... You can tell it's just a Sayori bow! <laughs> Damn right, Slav girl. Let's go. It's so beautiful. I've been longing for this moment. AK? Hey, hey. Yeah? Briet, I'm really glad you came with me, you know. So am I. 
Want to do something before our time on stage? We have a little while. Yee, that'd be cool. Why don't we go do some balloon shooting? Huh, do you even know how to handle weapons, Slav? Sika, of course. Do you think we use Kalanishkovs every day and you'll... Oh, I actually got that right. I was... I don't know if is that, whatever. I can't tell if she is a stereotype or if Russian's really that way. Okay, let's do some balloon shooting then. Thank you! Look at my skill, yeah! We approach the balloon shooting booth. Slavyori takes a rifle. What a bad caliber, be it! My Kalishnikov would be... Slavyori, keep it down. You don't want people hearing about your Kalishnikov. Alright, here goes! She shoots down all the balloons and almost kills the instructor. Be careful, for God's sake! <laughs> Sorry, I'm so used to shooting people! I look like I haven't heard anything. But hey, I won! Yeah, I got the plushie! She's a mix of a kid and a Russian. What the hell? Congrats! Now, I don't want to push you, Slav girl, but our represent our presentation is starting soon. It's already time! Yep, we're gonna have to go in the gymnasium. They decided to move the state inside. Okay, let's go and give it our best, Ike! Okay? The thumbs up! I practiced this weekend. I wink at the crowd and do my double thumbs up. One person is clapping. That's good enough. Thanks, everyone. Tanked. Slaviori, do you think you can come with me for a minute? Beat, of course! It's all or nothing now. What you said back in the gymnasium. It was touching. Thanks. No problem, Slav girl. Alright. Slaviori, you're Russian. You're mean. You're walking. No, squatting stereotype. Yet, I love you, Slaviori. Holy crap, I did it. Be a dick! I can't believe it. The Jiminy Cook is following you now! She jumps to hug me. <laughs> is it necessary to notice she is still squatting while hugging me? Me too. Me too, AK. I was so scared you'd fall for someone else. Never. You're too special to me. Sika, I'm relieved. I really can't believe it. She takes out a little bottle of vodka and drinks it. Hey, Slum Girl, leave some for me. She emptied the bottle already. Yes, yeah, sorry. I'll get, go get some drinks. You stay here. I'll be right back. And she squats away towards the stands. Oh my god, I can't believe it went this way. I shouldn't be happier. And then, really the same thing. This is just how we're living our lives now. Get up on out of here, Monica. I'm not done. We've got to go deeper. We've got to find the final girl.